afternoon, sis, and welcome back to my channel. It is me, Chloe Yasmeen, the hygiene queen. And in today's video, I am going to be doing something that I have never done before, but I feel like it's gonna be one of my best videos in life. So, in today's video, as y'all can tell, I am going to be going hygiene shopping for my sisters. Now when I say sisters, I mean my subscribers because y'all family to me and y'all are my sisters, okay? Did she really just pull up next to us and we parked all the way over here to Why? avoid? That's the weirdest thing. Okay, I literally pulled far away in the parking lot to make this introduction because like it gets a little awkward with people looking into the car. And this lady literally just pulled up like right <laughs> next to us. What is that? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. There's an older lady in the car too, so she's gonna have to walk all the way over there. She gonna walk all the way to that door because we driving over there. I'm a little socially awkward sometimes. <laughs> but anyways, what, I, what was I saying? Yes, I am going to be going hygiene shopping for my sisters. Okay, today's video is going to be a giveaway video. I am going to go into the store, get a bunch of hygiene products, put them in a box, and ship them off to the two winners of the giveaway. But of course, we gotta figure out how do we enter this giveaway. So it is going to be all through email. So you're gonna wanna go ahead and email this email right here. This is the email you want to email. Title that email giveaway so we know that it is for the giveaway. So make the subject giveaway. Please provide your name and your age as well as a picture of yourself. I wanna put a name with a face, okay? I'm pretty sure that's how you say that, mm -hmm. right? So. Face with a name, name with a face. And also provide a picture showing that you are subscribed to my channel. Tell me how long you have been watching my channel and tell me your top fave video of mine's. And then last but not least, of course, of course, please provide your correct shipping address. I'm talking look over that address a million times if you have to because once I ship the product out to that address, it is out of my hands. So please 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 provide the correct address the correct address I would be so sad if one of you guys provided the wrong address and it got shipped to somebody else or it had to get sent back or something like that now how long do you guys have to enter this giveaway you guys have 48 hours from the time I post this video to enter the giveaway once the 48 hours is up we are going to choose not really choose what I plan on doing is kind of like typing in giveaway and email and just randomly picking two people so you guys have 48 hours to enter this giveaway. Please do not mind my hair, y'all. It's a mess. I got it wet in certain spots, and I just did not feel like doing anything with my hair, so do not mind that. But 48 hours, okay? I want to give enough time for you guys to be able to watch this video and get entered all in. I do want to say, though, and there is no restrictions. This ain't me telling y'all you can't enter, but I do want to say, if you feel or if you know that somebody else could benefit more from this giveaway than you can, then just make the generous decision because I know there are a lot of young women and women period that maybe are not as fortunate financially and could benefit from these boxes tremendously okay so it don't mean you can't enter but if you feel somebody else could benefit a lot more than you can just make the generous decision now the people that win the giveaway will be receiving an email back from me confirming that you did win the giveaway and that I will be shipping your package off please do not be sad if you do not win this giveaway particularly because I do plan on doing more giveaways in the future I hope this video does well and I hope you guys really enjoy this video because I want to do a lot more giveaways in the future we might be starting something y'all so with that being said let's go into Walmart and let's put together these boxes girl and get them shipped out let's do it let's do it girl we are on to Target now because we were in Walmart and we were recording getting everything together yes ma'am and this employee with this dang stank face she looks at us and she's like and I'm like this girl is getting ready to say something like this girl is getting ready to say something hateration all the freaking way because I have talked to so many Walmart employees and they'll just be like oh my gosh like it's so cool like what's the YouTube channel like what is it called blah 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 not recording anybody not being rude and she's like you know you guys cannot be recording in here right I was like and like, what's the policy on that? It's on the front door. No, it's not on the front door. 
But what I'm not gonna do is let you control my day. It's such a coincidence that I have filmed in that Walmart so many times and nobody has ever said anything, but the day I want to give and give back to my sisters that always give to me, the devil uses somebody to go ahead and try to stop it. But it's not gonna stop it. I will go to a million stores until I get all of the footage that I need and all of the products that I need. So we are going to restart in Target. I pray and hope everything goes smoothly, but if not, we will go to another store and another store and another store because I am determined to put these boxes together for you guys as well as to film the content that comes with it. So we're gonna go ahead and go up in this Target and find everything that we need for these boxes and keep it pushing. Cause baby, that little stank face she had on her face, honey, you're bitter. You can tell bitter and mad people from happy for other people, people. Okay. So girl, let's get up in this Target and we're gonna try it again. Oh, what I was gonna say was this morning the Lord told me something's gonna try to block you and something is gonna try to get into your way because you're doing what's right. Being generous and giving is a part of being a Christian. And I don't show everything that I do and give on camera. I'm just not really that kind of person. But since I'm hygiene shopping for you guys, Y'all know I gotta film this, so let's go. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna start off with bar soap. So my bar soap of choice is going to be my favorite, well, one of my favorites, the cucumber um, and green tea. These smell amazing. Now we're gonna go on to body wash. Honestly, this isn't like a specific hygiene routine to where all of these go together. I'm just kind of like throwing my faves in there, okay? So second thing is going to be body wash and my top favorite body wash right now is, is my thing on? <laughs> Why is my light on? My top favorite body wash right now is the Olay Ultra Moisture Coconut Oil Body Wash, y'all. I love this body wash. This body wash smells so good. And I'm just gonna buy the same exact products for both boxes. Let's just play it safe. Same exact products for both boxes. We got our bar soap, we got our body wash. Since we're already here, we will grab deodorant and some shaving products. For deodorant, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a two pack of the Dove Cucumber and Green Tea. Uh, advanced care deodorants gotta love those yes ma'am and since like I said we're already here we can grab some shaving products for shave cream I'll grab a twin pack of the skintimate raspberry rain moisturizing shave gels and then for razors my favorite like affordable razors from Target are these I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of these actually these are better Ooh, look at these oh my gosh i'm gonna grab two value packs of the five blade razors by um up and up which is the target brand so we got our razors our shave cream deodorant body wash bar soap we need exfoliating gloves and lotion i'll look at my phone for the rest of it let's keep moving i use this lotion today y'all know i love my jergens hydrating coconut so i'll go ahead and grab two bottles of the jergens hydrating coconut oh my gosh y'all i I love this lotion so much it smells so good but girl I want to go use my lotion today and lock it chewed my whole entire handle up <laughs> chewed the whole handle I'm like was it was it delicious I'm not too fond of this hairstyle but so far we have our bar soap our body wash we got to get exfoliating gloves I got shave cream razors deodorant lotion the perfume I bought yesterday so I'll show you guys that once I leave the store but now we need exfoliating gloves I want to get some menstrual cycle products and some oral hygiene products and then I believe will be done if not we all know I got a hygiene collection so if I forgot something I'll provide it out of my hygiene closet I'm not gonna do shampoo and conditioners because I'm not really sure what would work for like everyone like all hair textures I, I'm gonna have to look into that a lot more but let me grab some exfoliating gloves right over here these came right off the what these came right off the the thing <laughs> that's not cool i didn't do it i so hope not but like i don't want to damage anything and then not buy it i'm sorry whoever gets the box that this came off the dang exfoliating gloves but i'm trying it y'all now i'm getting hot maybe somebody set you up maybe they broke it already and it was already just hanging from a maybe thread somebody set me up oh, okay right <laughs> okay so i got the exfoliating gloves and i said oral hygiene as well as menstrual cycle products so let's go the menstrual cycle products i'm just gonna go with my favorite pads so i'm just gonna grab two boxes of the always pure cotton in the size two pads and these are for a heavy flow i have a heavy flow so this is what i use all right so we got our pads 
Maybe I should throw in some more pads though because pads are really pricey and I know it could really help if I just provide some more. So I'll provide, yeah, another box of pads for each box. Is this size two? Yeah. Can you grab another size two? Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Perfect, so two boxes of pads per box. I seen something, like an article about Michigan um, not taxing menstrual cycle products anymore. If that's true, good job, Michigan. All right, so now that that's done, we can go grab some oral hygiene products and then we should be good. Okay, my favorite toothpaste is the Colgate Optic White and then my favorite mouthwash is the Smart Mouth Clinical. So I'll grab two of those. And I think we have completed our trip. Awesome. I've been I've been nervous the whole time though, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it kind of threw me off, the whole Walmart situation. Yeah, I know, something like that happens and you start to overthink other stuff. And yeah, then, yeah, when I get I it get done, you. it's just I feel mm -hmm. like I'm not as comfortable, but we got it done. Yes, we did. that was a success i even got a couple extra little trinkets to put in the boxes yes ma'am we got everything we needed for these boxes and i am so excited to put them together and finally ship them out in 48 hours like i am so excited i'm not gonna lie y'all I was a little bit nervous and like anxious in the store because of what happened in Walmart. I was a little irritated about it, so I wasn't like the most bubbly and talkative. I was just trying to get it out of the way. But I'm proud of myself because I got it done. I'm such like a shy person when it comes to stuff like that. Like I'll kind of like shut down and then I'll begin like overthinking things and then it just becomes a mental mess. But I just feel like when you go through so much stuff, like you're just so much stronger and things don't bother you as much. So had that happened maybe like a couple months ago, I probably would have been a little bit more timid about it and been like, maybe I'll just try again tomorrow. But I'm like, girl, get the heck up out of here. You playing with me right now. Like I'm hooking my sisters up. I see that you're mad, but you can't stop what I have going on. Okay, you ain't gonna stop what I got going on. I'm extremely determined and excited. It's just, your girl got a little nervous in the store. Like, is people about to tell us to get out again? But no, nah. I've even had the Target security come up to me and been like, oh, what are you guys doing? You're recording? Oh, that's cool. That's that's so cool. Have a great day. <laughs> like, Target, they be cool, but you don't want to speak too soon or anything. Anyway, let's get home and put these boxes together, baby. How do you even open up this tape? I think there's a, let me see. A tab? Oh, I don't see nails on. Yeah, my nails, they're making everything difficult. I got a little cheap nails on from Walmart. I showed y'all these nails in my mom and I's hygiene shopping haul. They cheap, but they're cute, y'all. Yeah, they're really nice looking to me. Get you some, but not from that Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. They make it so difficult with the tape. So we had to buy really big boxes because this is like all they had. The other boxes were like super tiny. So we got some big boxes here, but the perfumes that I picked up for these boxes, I actually went out and got these yesterday. I bought two Rihanna Rebel Floor um, gift sets. If y'all know, you know. Rebel Floor is like one of my top favorite affordable perfumes. This perfume, I have got a crazy amount of compliments on. When I tell y'all this stuff is strong, long lasting, beautiful, woman like, okay, and it smells so expensive. The Ribble Floor by Rihanna. So that will be the fragrance for these boxes. So I have two of those. I also went into my hygiene closet and I picked up two brand new packets of Orbit Spearmint Gum. I love gum so I wanted to go ahead and include that in the boxes. Boy that tape noise is bothering me. Oh me too. You got the scissors? Yeah. You know how old those scissors are? My dad bought me those scissors for sixth grade year. Sixth grade? And you still got them? Sixth grade, yes, sixth grade. Dang. I also found two packs of brand new flushable wipes. So I'm also going to go ahead and include these in the boxes. So we got a little extra things up in here. Flushable wipes, gum, perfume. I bought some cute little hand creams and lip gloss and back brushes. Just to go ahead and fill these boxes up. I got to hook my sisters up. Okay. I hate that noise. I know you do. Oh That's my god! I was waiting because you were talking too. 
It is kind of obnoxious. Go over that about two times, and then this way as well. Thank you, baby. When I tell y'all this man will help me with absolutely anything I need or want in life, he'll put my socks on, he'll put my shoes <laughs> on, he'll do absolutely anything I need him to do. It is the sweetest thing in life. Just be like that. I love you. I love you too. When a man tells you he loves you, his actions will show it. You can't always go by what these men be talking about. He will show you he loves you by the way he treats you. You know what's crazy? Is they call the good men, you know these women be like, ain't no good man out here. But then y'all call the good men pushovers. And y'all call the good men doormats. No, they're good men. I always wanted a man that was very humble and not legitimately, but like worship the ground that I walked on. Perfect. Do some big old boxes, babe. <laughs> For real. Oh my goodness. I'm not going to bubble wrap every single thing because every single thing won't need to be bubble wrapped. Um, I'm probably going to take the top of the body washes to make sure those don't spill. But certain things like the razors and the back brushes and like the toothpaste, those don't really need to be wrapped. Okay. Maybe the toothpaste actually. The toothpaste just in case? Because they're like tubes, yeah. I'll right. tape the top of them. We'll see as we go. The first things I'm going to put, you think I should put these boxes in first with the perfume or? I think so. I think you should, yeah, like you're gonna do bow wrap them, we can put those on the bottom. Okay. Since they're like the whitest thing. Okay, so I'm gonna bubble wrap these. Yeah, we definitely needed that other bubble wrap. Okay, I didn't know it was gonna wrap that. Yes, so I found some more bubble wrap in my trunk because I don't tell everybody everything that I do, but I did ship um, packages to subscribers before without, of course, announcing it. Um, it was just kind of like, hey, can you help me with this? And I'm like, absolutely. So I do have yellow bubble wrap from the times that I did ship out products to people. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and bubble wrap these perfume boxes. This bubble wrap was expensive for how fast it's going by. It is true. You think we should really bubble wrap these things? I mean, I think so just in case. These some dull scissors. <laughs> I see the way you're going through. Golly, these really from sixth grade. One layer, it's already taken up a bunch of wrapping paper or bubble paper and it's not even really doing anything. Just bubble wrap it. I don't care. Here, there you go. It's something. It's extra cushion. So yeah. first perfume in the first box. As y'all can tell, I do not know what I'm doing. Second perfume in the second box. For the body washes, I'm going to go ahead and tape the caps just to make sure these don't like bust open while they're in the mail. So I'm going to go ahead and tape the caps. But I'm honestly thinking more cushion for the perfumes if we put the pads on the bottom. Because I feel like they'd be throwing these boxes and that's glass perfume. So maybe we should put things like the flushable wipes and the pads on the bottom because nothing's going to happen to those. Yeah, we can do that then. Okay, this body wash is ready to go. Actually, it won't hurt to bubble wrap it just a little. They ain't maybe taxing for this dang bubble wrap because this ain't doing nothing. There you go. Awesome. And same thing for this body wash. And then I'm going to hand you the pads to put underneath the perfume. Right. So there's two boxes of pads per box. Okay. So that's for the first box. This will be for the second box. And then of course, one flushable wipe each box. Okay. Exfoliating gloves don't really need to be wrapped. So we can put one of those in each box. Mm -hmm. Razors, same for that. Honestly, at this point, we should just be recording the boxes. Because what the heck am I doing? Hey guys, like look at my face some more. <laughs> what the heck am I doing? I don't know. All right, we are getting these boxes all put together. So we've got all those things in there. Here are some razors for both boxes. Bar soap. Toothpaste. Okay. I'm going to take these shave gels as well. Number one. You're so cute! <laughs> you showing the camera! <laughs> and number two. One. I'm gonna write fragile on these boxes. Here's the first taped lotion. The second taped lotion. Look a little bootleg. I'm sorry about that, y'all. <laughs> Here is the first bubble wrapped mouthwash. Second bubble wrapped mouthwash. Deodorants. Here's the gum. Hand lotion creamies. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
And then, if I'm not mistaken, last but not least, here are the Tree Hut Lip Butters. Gotta have that. Is that everything? I think it is. I'm pretty sure that's everything as well. Oh my gosh, these boxes are not really filled because they're so big. <laughs> okay, so I actually have an idea for the cute little trinkets. I have cute little gift bags. These cute, like, little light pink gift bags. I could put the gum and like the lip butter and hand cream in yeah that was way too bright okay so this is what the cute like little gift bags are looking like i need to order more cute packaging stuff if i'm gonna be doing this i want to do it the right way <laughs> This is so cute. Okay, the second bag. Yay! I love that. Oh my goodness. That was so smart of you. That was really smart. Honestly, it wouldn't hurt to put some things in these little envelopes. Like, I could put the deodorant in here. And I could put the toothpaste in here. Because these are already, like, bubble wrapped. So I'll put that mm, in here. Smart. Yeah. All right. Cute. Mm -hmm. Love it. So that's everything? That's everything. I'm going to write fragile. Do you have a um, Sharpie? I'm going to spray some perfume in there. Yes, ma'am. Gotta have it smelling good. And we are set. We're good to go. Yes. Yay. I'm going to sign the box on the inside. I'm gonna put my initials. Love you. Sorry, y'all, my handwriting's disgusting. Oh my god, it's not true. Love you. All right, you guys, so we just completed the boxes. As y'all can tell, Jordan folded this one in wrong, but hey, it is what it is. I wrote fragile on both boxes. I really hope whoever wins this giveaway enjoys the products that I put in these boxes. I'm hoping you guys want to see more of these giveaway videos because I would love to do a feminine hygiene version and just start doing like little mini giveaways and just random videos, maybe some book giveaways and just random like products and item giveaways and if you guys do want to see more videos like this of course in the next videos I'm gonna be a lot more organized I feel like today's video is like all over the place just because of like what happened at Walmart which wasn't that serious but it kind of knocked me off my organization game um I managed very well but organization wise not the best I didn't really give too much of a background with the products but if you do watch my channel a lot you know all about these products and that I've raved about them a lot but anyways once again you want to go ahead and email this email right here no other email but this email right here titled giveaway with all of the required actions to enter this giveaway so that concludes today's video i'm really hoping and praying that these items bless someone and really help someone out and just put a smile on somebody's face for the holidays i'm really excited to go ahead and ship these out and i'm also excited for what the future holds which i'm unsure of but i'm pretty sure y'all are gonna love these videos so i can continue to do more of these videos and the more y'all like these videos, the more gift boxes I'll be able to ship out. So with that being said, once again, to enter the giveaway, go ahead and go back to the intro and go through all those rules to enter and you are entered into the giveaway. And you have a chance to win one of these two boxes. So with that being said, I love every single one of you guys. God bless you all in Jesus name. And it's time for your girl to go.